Six people in South Korea contracted COVID-19 despite receiving their first vaccine shots. The main issue is ensuring recipients avoid infection while waiting for the second dose. Kim do explains further. Six people who received the first round of COVID-19 vaccination shots have been confirmed with the virus. This as a Monday, meaning the number could increase. Infection is possible if not enough antibodies has been formed and also if the person got infected beforehand. So this situation is not unusual, nor is an error. Of the six, three are medical workers from National Medical Center in Seoul, which rolled out Pfizer vaccines to medical workers fighting on the front line against COVID-19. Information on the other three is yet to be released. Meanwhile, the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says wearing face masks and practicing social distancing isn't necessary among people who have received their second vaccine dose, and more than two weeks have passed since. And it's also okay for them to visit households with unvaccinated people as long as they aren't in the high-risk group. South Korean health authorities are hesitant to confirm whether this will be the case here. No one in South Korea has received their second dose of the vaccine yet, and because it will be a while before enough data is analyzed, CDC's new guidelines aren't applicable. There is always going to be a small portion of the population that does not gain immunity after the second dose, so in order to have full effect, we have to wait to achieve herd immunity. Eleven days since the vaccination rollout began, more than 380,000 South Koreans have been given their first doses, mostly of the AstraZeneca vaccine. This is nearly half of those who are in the first priority group, frontline medical workers and staff and residents and nursing homes. In addition, the vaccination task force revealed that there will be two 500,000 dose deliveries of Pfizer vaccines in late March. Kim Do-yeon, Arirang News.